Hello, welcome to the channel. We reached 1,000 subscribers. Thank you very much for your support. Cristiano Ronaldo will not win a major trophy at Al Nasser. Cristiano Ronaldo's hopes of enjoying a trophy laden and his career are quickly fading. The Portuguese legend was the most transformative signing in Saudi Arabian football history, and his arrival in 2023 ushered in an era of unprecedented spending. However, if Ronaldo expected the twilight of his career to be as illustrious as his early years, he was sadly mistaken. The ambitious striker has scored 34 goals in all competitions for Al Nasser this season, but his team will not win a major trophy. Of course, they've already won the Arab Club Champions Cup, essentially a preseason tournament, and still have a chance of winning the King Cup, Saudi Arabia's national competition. However, the most important trophies will elude Ronaldo this season and potentially next season too. The Riyadh Giants are miles away in the Saudi Pro League, a staggering 12 points behind city rivals Al-Hilal at the top. Al Nasser are also out of the AFC Champions League after a game that illustrated exactly why Ronaldo and co. will end the campaign empty-handed. Surrounded by bottlers? Al Nasser's Champions League quarterfinal second leg against UAE side Alain was an instant classic. The Saudi team entered the game with a 1-0 deficit from the first leg, and it looked like their fate was sealed when Al Ain opened up a two-goal lead at the end of the first half. However, Al Nasser regained the advantage and ended up taking a 3-2 lead and sending the game into extra time. However, Al Ain scored again, and with the Saudis now down to 10 men, the game looked over. But then Ronaldo stepped forward. The Riyadh team received a penalty in the 118th minute and the Portuguese converted. Penalties were therefore necessary to decide a winner. Alain, maintaining their performance in both legs, converted the penalties without much fuss. Al Nasser players, however, succumbed under pressure. In fact, it was the players you would least expect who missed the penalties. Ronaldo was the only one to score, with Marcelo Brozovic and Alex Tell seeing their shots saved before Otavio, signed for 60 million euros, hit the penalty kick. What worries Ronaldo and Al Nasser, apart from the fact that the club's big players have really bottled up the situation, is that hated rivals Al Hilal will only get stronger in the summer. The Saudi champions are planning another spending spree and could gamble on Mohamed Salah, with al Ittihad also still interested, as revealed by football transfers. Al-Hilal have dominated this season despite Neymar being injured for most of it. With Jorge Jesus' team investing even more and the Brazilian star potentially back next season, Al Nasser will face an uphill battle to compete in the Pro League or Champions League.